It's safe to say that 2020 has been a year for the books, and in the midst of this pandemic, now we're learning about a murder hornet that has made its way into the United States for the first time. It's images like this that seem straight out of a nightmare. At more than two inches long, the Asian giant hornet is the world's largest hornet. The giant insect is nicknamed the murder hornet. It comes straight out of Hollywood in terms of what you think an evil alien might look like. Biological science professor James Nye says the invasive hornet species originates in Asia and is especially troubling for honeybees. The hornets hunt for food in beehives and can wipe out a hive in just a few hours, decapitating the bees in the process. An infestation could be devastating for beekeepers as well. In fact, the giant hornets have caused millions of dollars of crop damage in France. These types of predators are largely generalist, so they're not only looking for honeybees, they'll be looking for native bumblebees or anything else that they can kind of catch. Then there's the threat to humans. Their stings can deliver nearly seven times the amount of venom as a honeybee, strong enough to kill, but they rarely attack unprovoked. The insect was first sighted in Washington state in December. They likely migrated from Canada. So it raises the question, how did they get to North America in the first place? I went to professor for pollinator health at UC Riverside, Boris Baer, to find out. Um, you have um, queens that are um, they hide away to overwinter, uh, and so they can end up in, in shipping uh, that is put on, on boats or something like that. They could, in principle, um, travel in cargo holds of airplanes. Right now, the insect has only been spotted in Washington state, but experts say that could change. So if they are happy up there, I don't see any reasons why they would not start to spread and, and come further down. And state officials have set up traps in hopes of slowing the spread of this insect. Reporting in West Hollywood, I'm Chris Holmstrom, KCAL 9 News.